Welcome back. The Opportunity Center for the Homeless is teaming up with the El Paso Chihuahuas baseball team for a community event to support homeless programs. Here to share more information about the 11th annual home run for the homeless 5K is John Martin. He's the deputy director for the center. Thank you so much for being here, well, John. Thank you for having me here. Absolutely. All right. This is the 11th year of the marathon. Tell us all about the event. What can people expect and who can apply? Well, in this particular case, it uh, comes up a week from Saturday, which will be Saturday, August the 3rd. Uh, we will shoot the starting gun at about 8 o'clock in the morning, and typically everything will wrap up about 11 o'clock. Mm -hmm. But this is a family event, and that's one of the main issues that I want to bring across. We do have the competitive run for the runners that we have here in El Paso. We also have what I refer to as a recreational run, both 5Ks. Mm -hmm. And then at the close of those two races, we have the Kids Dash, which is around the ballpark at Southwest University That's Park, awesome. thanks to El Paso Chihuahuas. That's very cute. Okay, so fun for the whole family. It doesn't matter if you're a professional runner or, you know, you run every day. Anyone can join. And tell us, uh, what are the proceeds going towards? Well, in this particular year, we're going to be benefiting our veterans programs with uh, a target on the Veterans Transitional Living Center. Uh, these are homeless veterans that need a little bit more time as they move from homelessness into their own housing. Mm -hmm. And tell us, you guys do so much for the community. What exactly is the need here uh, for veterans, but just for homeless population in El Paso as well? Well, we have two different programs that focus on the veterans. One's an emergency shelter for both men and women, and then we have the transitional living center for the men. And as is consistent with our mission statement, we transition those that can. And by that, we're saying that we're transitioning them out of homelessness. Mm -hmm. And so the needs are during that initial period as they move into housing, and then the needs continue because we don't simply want to put them into housing. We want to make sure that they're able to sustain that housing as well. Mm -hmm. Great. You do a lot of work for this community. And uh, to wrap it up, uh, tell us once again, what is the best way to apply? Is there a deadline to apply for the race? Well, basically, it's really easy to do. Uh, we work with Mike Coulter at Race Adventures, so just go to raceadventuresunlimited.com. You'll follow the prompts. You can register for the event. And then we just simply want to see your beautiful face and that of your family uh, to show up that Saturday morning on August the 3rd at 8 o'clock. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much, John, for joining mm -hmm. us this afternoon. You heard it all August 3rd at 8 in the morning. You can go ahead and apply. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this break.